Hi, everybody. My name is Eleanor. I love cooking with my mommy and daddy. I'm here to show you that good food doesn't have to be complicated. It can be so easy that a little kid like me can be able to do it. I'll show you how. Here on Kids Cook. Always loved eggs, scrambled eggs, omelets, shakshuka, duck, wait, I've never had them. Today's dish has a lot of different names. Egg nest, egg in a basket, eggs in the snow, baked birdies in a nest. They call them cloud eggs. And the egg farm was Ontario in 1976. Just call it the 42 cent lunch. Whatever you call it, it's easy and so yummy. And it looks really fancy too. You only need a few ingredients. You can see I have mise en place. Daddy says that's French for not having everything be a giant mess all the time. I don't think that's really what it really means. Preheat your oven to 400 degrees. Let's start by separating our eggs. Don't crack your eggs on the cup or the mixing bowl because you don't want shell in your eggs. I have a soft spot and it's really good we cracked, I'm pretty sure. Well, that wasn't the best open, but it was pretty good. Pour the white into the mixing bowl and then do it again with the next egg. We do the whites one at a time to avoid getting shell in. That way if you make a mistake you only ruined one egg and not two. Start your blender up slowly so it doesn't splash. Then I'll set mine up to eight. How long this takes depends on how fresh your eggs are and how cold they are. When the eggs start to foam, add in a pinch of salt. Keep blending it until stiff peaks form. Add your cheese. Use a rubber spatula to gently fold the cheese in, going from the sides along the bottom and then folding over. You don't want to pop all the bubbles you just made. Gently mound up your egg whites onto the toast. Make a little nest where your yolk is supposed to go. I'm just gently using the back of my spoon. Bake it for about three minutes or until it starts to turn golden. <laughs> and then I carefully pick it up. And gently slide it in. Then have your mommy or daddy pull it out of the oven for you. Gently pour the yolk into the nest, and then bake for two more minutes. <laughs> These look perfect. Garnish with chives or dill and a pinch of finishing salt. I 
that's why kids cook. Wow. That is really good. Really, really good. For real. It's not a good egg. Okay. I don't think I'm the one who should be doing this egg. <laughs>